Hey guys, it's Linux Benchmark here, and in today's video, I wanted to talk about and show you guys uh, some results of testing out different kernels and to see which kernel is actually good for playing games under Linux. But of course, before this video starts, here is a word from our great sponsor. Today's sponsor is Proton VPN, one of the most secure and private VPNs in the world with over 3k servers in 71 countries. Try it out for free to see if you like it with Proton VPN supporting Android, Windows, Mac OS, even Linux, the operating system that I use. Pay 10 bucks a month with 30 day back guaranteed if you don't like it. Also, Proton VPN offers Proton Mail, one of my favorite mailing applications that protects your emails with end to end encryption so no one can read them at all no matter how hard they try if you really want to try what proton vpn has to offer go to the link in the description and sign up today so uh, what kernels are we using in today's video for this testing? Uh, so we did test uh, the Ligris kernel, the Zermod kernel, the Zen kernel, the Stop kernel, and the Cache's OS kernel. And I decided to do around five games as I don't have a lot of games that can actually do uh, benchmarks, plus one game that I just had to go into uh, training to test that out. Uh, but as we can see here, the first game that we decided to do one is Cyberpunk 2077. So I didn't use any FSR on this and the graphics stuff we used on cyberpunk were around medium settings with the crowd density on medium as well and as we look at these results here here is a one percent lows our maximum and our average if we have a look at these one percent lows we can see that licorice got around 46 xamod got 50 zen uh, got 58 stock got 57 and cashies always got 44 so uh stock in zen 58 57 that is quite a neck and neck uh licorice got 46 for some reason that's quite uh disappointing even though, you know, it's not that much of a difference, but it is still like, you know, Zen mod with 50 FPS as well. That's also quite disappointing as, you know, these kernels, um, people like to use them a lot for like gaming purposes as they can put like more performance out there. Uh, before Cyberpunk 2077 in the 1% lows, uh, these didn't perform that well. And same with uh, Kachi's OS. It just seems like Stock and Zen performed really well. And if we have a look at the maximum here, we got Licorice with 145. So that's where we can see, you know, Licorice does put out a high FPS when it comes to the maximum uh Zamo with 131 zen with 134 stock with 140 and cash is worse with 138 like i said it's looker has got 145 stock with 140 i'm seeing you no know, stock the stock kernel seems to be doing a pretty decent job and then we look at the average here we got licorice with 93.5 zen with zen mod with 97 zen with 98 stock with 99 and cash is worse with 98 so overall i would say that if you are playing cyberpunk I would probably just use the stock kernel or the maybe Cache's OS or even Zen maybe. Uh, for Licorice, I would say, yeah, it puts out a high maximum FPS, but it's 1% lows, you know, 46. Mm, and its average is only 93.5, which is still good. Uh, but So the next game we decided to test was the finals. This is a game that I really like to play. Uh, I've been playing it so much and I wanted to see uh, the performance on, on all these kernels. And as we can see here, uh, you know, the, the graphic settings that we decided to do was a mixture of low and medium with global illumination on epic settings uh, for some reason i think it just didn't make uh, that much of a performance impact but what i decided to do was go into the training mode instead of the online matchmaking as that would make it more inaccurate and i decided to shoot mannequins and see what would happen uh, with this uh, benchmark and as we can see here with the one percent lows it is uh, really uh, inaccurate so we can see like stock with 52 zen mod with 40 licorice with 63 zen with 75 and cash is os with 70 but if you look at the maximum here, uh, we got Licorice 175, which is quite disappointing. We have Zen Mod with 192, Zen with 190, Stock with 186, and Cashews OS with 178. So if it was my decision, I would probably run the Zen kernel or the Stock kernel. I uh, probably wouldn't run Licorice as, as much on this game. And uh, if you have a look at the average, we got uh, Licorice with 129, Zen Mod with 132, Zen with 139, Stock with 134.9, and then Cash is worse with 133. Overall, with the finals, I'd probably, like I said, I'd probably use Stock or Zen Mod or even the Zen kernel with that matter. With Licorice not doing that great of a job, which is quite you know, disappointing as I was using uh, Licorice kernel. I didn't see that many um, performance impact actually in a match, but as you can see, here from this data that I collected, it, it seems like you know, Zen stock and Zen mod seem to be doing a really good job. And 
Ashes OS is kind of just uh, chilling, I guess you could say. It's not, it's not really doing an amazing job, but it's also not doing a really bad job. It's kind of just in between. Uh, the next game we decided to try was Guardians of the Galaxy. Uh, this was on high settings with no FSR. And if we have a look at these 1% loads, we can see uh, Licorice at 60, uh, Zen Mod at 56, Zen 58, Stock 57, and Cashes OS at 60. So not bad when it comes to the 1% loads. They're all rather the same. Uh, we're going with a couple little FPS difference if i redid these it'd probably be basically the exact same or a bit different for each one maybe like you know Zamod could do 58 and then zen would do 56 so not much of a difference for that but if you look at the maximum fps uh, liquid is 114 zen mod with 114 zen with 111 stock with 111 and then cash is always with 111 as well again it's all around the same with even zen mod and liquid hitting 114 which is quite um funny that they decided to hit the exact same number um, and then same with Zen and Cashes of Westwood getting 111 so when it comes to this game I would say you know you could use any kernel and it would get a good experience out of it uh, Liquorice with 85 Zen with 85 Zen with 84 Stock with 79 and Cashes of Westwood 83.9 again the exact same with Liquorice and Zen mod when it comes to playing Guardians of the Galaxy you could literally just use any kernel you want uh, and it probably would perform pr pretty much fine uh, there wouldn't be any uh, real performance issues and we have a look at the next game which is Rainbow Six Siege and this game doesn't work uh, online actually the Rainbow developers don't want to support Linux but you can still launch the game and go into training so that's what I decided to do was I, I decided to uh, benchmark it with the benchmark that Rainbow has and if we have a look at these 1% lows uh, Liquorice got 153 Zen mode got 150 Zen got 132 Stock got 144 Ashes of Worst got 146.5 uh, and then if you have a look at the maximum Liquorice got a 340 45, Zen mod got 336, Zen got 340, Stock got 340, Cash to West got 327. So if you look at these maximum and the 1% lows so far, we can see that Lictris is doing quite a good job on Rainbow Six Siege. And if we have a look at the average here, Lictris with 225, Zen mod with 229, Zen with 209, Stock with 225, and then Cash to West with 226.6. So with the average, um, you know, Lictris doesn't do that, uh, it, does a, it does a decent job, but not much in the average department but uh, it seems like Xamod seems to pull the most out of the average uh, aspect of Rainbow Six Siege uh, but if it was a kernel that I would probably use in Rainbow it would probably just be like Stock or Zen probably maybe Licorice and maybe Kashi's OS Kashi's OS again kind of just kind of just chilling it's not really doing anything crazy um, it, we also have like the ball scheduler on Kashi's OS and uh, that doesn't seem to really really doing that much of a difference for gaming the gaming aspect of using the, the ball scheduler and then when we have a look at our last game here which is red dead redemption 2 we can have a look at the one percent lows on here uh 56 on licorice zen mod 57 zen 55.4 stock 60 cashes os 55 not too bad all of these kernels did a really good job with the one percent lows and then if you have a look at the maximum here we got licorice with 113 zen mod with 111.4 zen with 114.7 stock with 113 cashes os with 112 and then we have a look at the average licorice at 89.5 zen mod at 88.3 zen 90.3 stock 90 cash os west 86.2 so with red dead redemption 2 i would say that you could probably also use just about any kernel and you would get a good experience and i would say that you don't have to use custom kernels uh, in my opinion you really can just use the stock kernel or maybe you can just use zen i know zen gets used on arch uh, uh distros like you can install the zen kernel on Endeavor OS's installer if you want to so you could use Zen or stock or really any of them and get a good experience and that's where my conclusion comes around is what kernel should you use like I said stock or Zen it doesn't really matter necessarily uh, you're gonna get performance like pretty decently I would test the majority of these kernels out to see which one you know you get a better performance out of uh, I know you can you can install Zen mod licorice uh, and pretty easily on like Ubuntu based distros and Fedora and Arch uh, but on Zen Zen, uh, I think Zen kernel can only be installed on Arch. I think it can be installed on other distros, but it's like maybe a bit more difficult to do. Um, and same with Caches OS, that kernel is uh, part of an Arch-based distro called Caches OS. So when it comes to using that kernel, you either grab it from the uh, AUR or you could probably build it on whatever other distro that you're running. So what kernel would I use personally? Well, I would probably use the Zen kernel or the stock kernel, or if it was out of curiosity, I'd probably 
use Licorice, um, all the cash is always. I don't really care about Zen mod that much. It didn't seem to really perform. It can perform decently, but not really much of a fan of Zen mod. Uh, mostly because of like the name. <laughs> I would probably say I like uh I like the other names more like cash is always Zen Licorice. They're more cooler names, I guess you could say. Uh, but even in like performance, it's not that great. I mean, cash is always does seem to perform a lot worse than Zen mod. So maybe I will try and use Zen mod a lot more. But overall, the kernel that I would probably use would probably be the Zen or the stock kernel. So with that out of the way, uh, tell me the thoughts down below what you what what kernel you use on your system, uh, what kernel you prefer when it comes to gaming under Proton. If you actually switch to a different kernel to get better performance out of your your games under Proton. Um, and I want to thank the sponsor of today's video, Proton VPN. Uh, I remember someone asked about uh, if I actually use Proton VPN and, and Proton Mail, and I actually do use Proton Mail. I don't use Proton VPN as I don't actually just, I just have our own a VPN subscription as I don't need one. Uh, but for mail, I do use Proton v, uh, Proton Mail as my main mailing application. So I would definitely click the link down below if you want to sign up and actually like maybe even pay for like a subscription um, if you have the money. If not, I would probably still try like Proton Mail or you can try Proton VPN for free to see the servers that they have for free, which probably aren't going to be that great until you actually pay, but there'll be a, probably a decent experience. And of course, I want to thank the um, my supporters on this channel. I'll put an image up uh, right now. Uh, thank you guys for paying monthly to me. I appreciate it. Uh, you don't actually have to do that, uh, but I always do appreciate it when people do uh, do that uh, and I will probably just see you guys in the next video. Of course, you can like this video. You can uh, subscribe to me. I have also recorded this video like four times now because I kept um, mucking the audio up. So <laughs> yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs> Peace.